iNews Views, June 29th. Success is a little like wrestling a gorilla. You don't quit when you're tired. You quit when the gorilla is tired. Robert Strauss. Korea's elitist college system may be on the way out. Newly elected superintendents have vowed to revamp the existing college system so students are evaluated on their ability and not just the name of the school they graduated from. A caste system is developed in Korea because of the emphasis on getting into a sky university. Character development and life experiences have taken a back seat to rote memorization of facts needed to get a good score on the college entrance test. Over half of students at top-tier schools report uninspiring lectures. Can change be at hand? Corporal punishment is a touchy subject in South Korea where a, a Seoul high school student was hospitalized with muscle tears after being forced to do 800 squats for failing to complete his homework. Direct corporal punishment has been outlawed in Korea since 2012, but the administration of physically grueling disciplinary exercises is still used in some schools. South Korean schools have come under increasing scrutiny for their focus on memorization and test-based assessment that promotes intense competition between students and stifles creativity and critical judgment. Starbucks is a truly global brand, but the city with the most shops is not New York or London, but Seoul, South Korea. Residents consider walking down the street with a Starbucks cup a status symbol, similar to carrying a famous brand handbag or wearing a designer suit. The coffee's high prices guaranteed continued prestige for the brand and profits for the shop owners. Wearable computers may not be so new. In the 17th century, a designer created a functioning smart ring that contained a miniature version of a Chinese abacus. Jing Dawi of the Ming Dynasty is credited with developing the calculator system in 1368. Phone calls were not possible with the abacus ring, but the discovery proves that wearable technology is not such a radical concept as some people think. Your posture affects your health. There is growing evidence that sitting up straight reduces back and joint pain and boosts our mood. Body alignment is the key. Ears over the shoulders, shoulders over the hips, and hips over the knees and ankles with body weight evenly distributed between the feet is the ideal posture. Don't hunch over when you're working on the computer and keep your core muscles in good shape to maintain health and happiness. Vertical corporate hierarchies are the, with their inefficiency and reduced collaboration were eliminated in 2006 at SK Telecom. Korea Telecom followed suit in 2009 and introduced a flatter corporate culture where employee titles were eliminated, but the telecommunications company is now turning back the clock. Older employees complain that they were made to feel inferior when meeting other companies' employees. Samsung and Hyundai say that strict employee hierarchies are the key to their success.